dear viewer today i will show you how to edit the tool uh, for the cnc and this is a different drawing and also the some important tips which is very vital for the cnc so i will uh, inform you the thing the first of all is uh, how to make new tools or how to edit new tools cnc tools okay the first i call click cnc tool path then here <coughs> the left corner the tool library then here is different kinds of tool this is flatten this is ball shape and this is nose end, and this is flat tapering normally you should use ball tapering for the brush ally both item <coughs> so here the first digit is the angle this angle here is the issue 15 and 30 30 normally we will use 30 and 0 0.1 30 0 0.2 30 0 0.5 actually uh, here 30 0 0.1 let's see its parameter if i want to edit then edit here you see this is the diameter tool diameter this diameter then angle a is the angle then tip diameter that means face length 0.1 this is d small d and cutting length and oh, clear length then we see the parameter if we see parameter here cutting speed ratio other all parameter here we will change only the feed rate feed rate will increase uh, 0.5 then we will make it ok the same way we also can click here edit uh, then uh, here everything is okay but we can change here then this 0 0.05 then okay if i want to make another new tool that time or if you, i want to delete that the time i can click that tool and then delete to delete if i want to make another new tool then i can click any of the tool and then new tool after that i can select here different type mouse type flatten angle flatten normally it is then taper angle it should be always 30 then tip diameter here i have 0 0.1 and 0 0.2 i will give now 0 0.15 normally we should use 0 0.15 to 0 0.2 <coughs> then the cutting length 0 0.5 and then fit. <coughs> now we'll click ok so ok so that's all that is the tool part now I will uh, show you actually the distance between this letter and this letter always should be minimum 0 0.05 to 0 0.1 millimeter I again repeat the distance between this and this should be uh, minimum 0 0.05 to 0 0.0.75 0 to 0 0.1 millimeter I again repeat 0 0.075 to 0 0.1 millimeter the distance and also the distance of this or this portion that means the thick, uh, width of the uh, letter should be minimum 
minimum 0.15 sometimes 0.1 on also acceptable because you know i uh, normally we should use that taper in face with tool taper face tool the angle should be 30 always but the face width is sometimes 0 0.15 and sometimes 0 0.2 and case to case we can use also 0 0.1 but we will try to avoid this uh, for the normal logo we should avoid this uh, distance this distance should be minimum 0 0.15 because otherwise if the tool diameter is face diameter is bigger than this then that react CNC will not cut just the no, normal basic so you should follow this <coughs> for a small logo that time we can use the tool 0 0.10 uh, millimeter and distance should be minimum of 0 0.10 millimeter so you know the brush item the brush item uh, for the brush item when we will use the CNC the CNC part should be uh, upward CNC part means if we want to do it on the copper then uh, the uh, CNC part will be always downward downward and for example the logo is upward detailing everything is upward that time we can reverse this uh, logo and then we can put here the downward for example this is the upward logo we can rotate this 180 degree that means just opposite and then we can select add a uh, downward like this and if there is both upward and downward logo then the cnc part first uh, we can use any option but the first step of the cnc part will be upward then the downward process uh, like this uh, it will do so I will uh, inform you how and, uh, uh, I will show you how to rotate this uh, design because this is upward I want to make it as uh, downward so how I, can, I could make it downward let's see how to do so first uh, let's see let's see <coughs> First, I will make, make this shape first. I'll make it down not river transfer and <coughs> then it's smooth is you can see now already reverse so now now we will make this logo reverse same way now make it reverse reverse now i can cut here as a downward because previous time it was upward but if i uh, cut another part then it will be downward now i can go for the work but you see here is the uh, no any space so it will not cut properly so first i have to shift this space but this you don't have to go this 
then cut this I have to change I already yeah I already uh, change adjust the position and then I'll uh, move this uh, logo uh, I'll move this logo now I'll, uh, I'll uh, take this logo uh, for me because I already adjust here um, some excess but already uh, includes so I'll click control and then click those line then it will automatically run select and then uh, transfer and will convert into 3d then I will go to 3d and this is the logo here no any space the first I have to select those words After that, I can select this word, transfer, rotate, reverse. After that, after that. I will select here this then add transfer on him now I will go for the now I will show you how to uh, select the CNC tool so first I will surface finish next surface finish then the tools I will use uh, taper angle 15 at uh, 30 degree and uh, diameter that means these 15 then next dash metal is brush then ok good, good. you see then select after that I will select this portion in the lettering and this portion will be the downward so that I'll select this and curve to that next
not coming so now what you can do Backside logo already logo cut. That's final.